Hi guys, how are you? Welcome back to my YouTube channel Best SAT Tips by Sebastian Enriquez and today I will be talking about how to register for the SAT and I will give you guys a update from the College Board webpage. Okay guys, so let's get started. For my subscribers and viewers from Mexico and Puerto Rico, Remember that the entire world is here to help you, even the college world. Okay guys, so let's get started. How to sign up in the college world webpage. Okay guys, as you can see here, this is my MacBook Air and then here I am going to put college board, college, not college readiness, okay guys, not college readiness. CollegeBoard.com. Look at the webpage right there. CollegeBoard.com. Um, guys, this is for the ones from the ones that are affected by the Hurricane Maria and the recent hurricanes. Alert! The College Board is offering a free SAT registration and CSS profile fee waiver to the students affected by the recent hurricanes. We are also working to identify school closures and delays that may affect PSAT and MSQT testing. Learn more. Okay, guys. I am not going to learn more, guys, okay, because we already know the situation. And, well, guys, from, from the people of Puerto Rico, peace, guys. I wish you peace and recover. Um, sign up. Create your college board account. I am an education professional or a student. Okay, we are all students, right? Or what's or that's what I think. Okay, guys. Okay, it is charging. Let's see. This is just guys a small video, okay? It's just for the ones that don't know nothing about the SAT. Um, if you already have an account, you can click here and sign in. Why create an account? Let's read it together. With a College Board account, you can access your SAT and AP scores online and send them to colleges. You can also register for the SAT and CLEP exams and print your SAT admission tickets or CLEP registration ticket. Additionally, an account lets you manage your personal college list, save your scholarship searches, compare cost of colleges that interest you, and more. So it is very useful. Um, it's okay, so here you put your name. Let's say, for example, customize. Let me see Sebastian. Sorry, guys. Sebastian, right? Middle initial, yeah. Uh, last name, my last name is Enrique. Oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> uh, my last name, Enrique. My last name is Enriquez. Um, sex, male. Date of birth, October. 16 2000 2001 I am a junior okay guys okay guys so this is here private information that I cannot give you guys but okay let's go through this together you need to put your email address you need to confirm your email address this is very important that's why you need to confirm it because this is your college board official account okay high school graduation or equivalent your state co postal code and, and this needs to be filled then if you're an international student like me guys you can press this button outside the US okay guys look outside the US where do you go to school what it's a basin? no that's a little mistake guys um, no, I cannot tell you guys the school that I go to, um, the school that I attend. Username and password, guys, you need to choose a username, it will have to 6 to 15 characters made up of letters and numbers. 
you should also have a password and confirm your password. A security question, guys, because this is very private. Um, subscription, stay connected, you may opt in the following months, list on a newsletter and alerts. Your parents' information, guys, this is very important too. And then I agree, of course, guys, you always need to agree with your terms and all things. I know that I am not going to register myself, okay, guys? Um, let's see what is going to happen. I know that this is a mistake, okay? It's just to try. Oh, well, yeah, submission and order. But I just wanted, guys, to show you how to register for the SAT, okay, guys? So this is the web page, the college board. Okay, guys? Well, guys. Thank you so much for everything and I will be uploading a video, I don't know guys, I think tomorrow, so wait for it. Thank you so much guys.